standard noodle. Oh, yes. Stir fry dumplings. Hey, everybody, it's Lady C, and it's Friday night. Boy, we have made it through the week. And once you made it through the week, hey, you got a few days to relax. Just let your mind go. Uh, you know, on the weekends, we try not to be in the kitchen too long. So it's Friday foodie night, and we go, and we've, we had some noodles in the fridge. We had eggs. You always usually have eggs. We had some veggies, which we normally have. Um, <clears throat> and of course, we had, my husband got me a little drinky drink Friday night, and the feeling's right. So, hey, cheers to everybody for making it through the week. Oh. There's a little bit of twisted tea. Um, and I got my water by my side, too. Um, but we're going to start off. I've got noodles, I've got pork uh, dumplings. I've got some hard-boiled eggs. I got some um, of the little uh, English cucumbers. They're not English, I forget, the little small cucumbers. Persian cucumbers, um, Persian cucumbers. thanks baby. And then I've got my sweet peppers. Um, I'm gonna show you all, my husband made a sauce for me to dip my eggs and my, new, well, my eggs in. And it's made out of sweet chili, sweet chili sriracha. sriracha, garlic, garlic hot sauce, hot sauce Sesame and a, and a little bit of vinegar. So I'm gonna use that for my dipping for my eggs. That's got a little kick to it. Then I've got a little sauce for my um, dumplings. I think he just used um, what'd you put in here, baby? Some um, gyoza sauce. Oh, some gyoza sauce. Sesame. Sesame. And some white vinegar. And white vinegar. That's what we use for the dipping sauce for your uh, dumplings. And then you see, can you see? It's like a darker sauce. It looks a little dark. Can you see that? Try to get that up there so you guys can see it. Okay, my noodles we got from the Asian market. And they're just basically instant noodles, but you're going to make it look pretty now. But um, this is the one, I mixed two packs. This is the one pack of noodles that I used. Um, these are just regular. They're not hot and spicy or any of that. Um, then I use these. Um, these I have never used before. These are hot and spicy. So I mix these in with the others. You know, just to give it a little kick, but not too hot. Um, for the dumplings, we get our dumplings from the Asian market too. And they come in a very large container. See how that? It holds a lot. I think we've had about three or four meals off this bag. Um, and it comes in this. These are pork and vegetable, you can get them just plain vegetable, you can get chicken and vegetable, you can get beef, you can get, I mean, they have every kind of dumpling you ever could know. Um, but these, I just wanna show you guys, these, this is what we use. Now let's get into this food. Um, it's Friday night, we've cleaned out the fridge, we haven't had to spend a lot of money, and it's time to eat. I don't use chopsticks, y'all. My husband gave them to me on the chance that I would use them, but I like to eat and I always have problems. <laughs> Maybe I'm malcoordinated. I have problems with the chopstick. So, mm. oh, those noodles are good, you guys. Give you just a little bit of kick from the hot and spicy. It's not too spicy. It's good. And he put a little bit of the green onion on here. Mm. good now I've never tried this so we're gonna try <coughs> our hard-boiled egg we eat hard-boiled eggs all the time we have a hard-boiled egg maker um, I'm gonna take this I'm gonna dip it in the sauce that we made for it oh look at that y'all oh that's good mmm Mm-hmm. Look at that. Can you see? Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm. So we got something going on. And we got our peppers. I mean cucumbers, I'm sorry. Mm. 
Here's your gum. Just a little bit of salt and pepper. Mm-hmm. Good. So you're getting your veggies. You got your cucumber, you got your peppers. Pepper. Dip it in a little bit of the sauce too. Bit of our Friday night drinky drink. So you all tell me how was the work week? Mm. Mm, I dump them. What was that? All that meat, that pork inside. And then it's got veggie. I dip it in a little bit of my dipping sauce. Bring it back. Look at that. Mm-hmm. That's good. Mm. I work from home. I haven't worked from home all the time in this job. My company ended up I'm having us work from home, which is fine. And everybody thinks, oh, it's so easy working from home. It is nice to be at home. I do what I'm supposed to do. So I feel like if you do what you're supposed to do and then you're finished, then you should be able to walk away and leave. But it doesn't work like that. Put in the comments what some of you guys do and how you're feeling about it. You know, I'm getting older. You know, you start thinking about things you could have done, what else you'd want to do. Mm. I don't know. A lot of things I wanted to do <laughs> as, uh, you know, a younger person, but, uh, you know, some of those things probably wouldn't have made me a lot of money. I am not rich, but I'm living. Now that I'm older, I think I could go pursue some of the things that are more pleasurable to me, more fun, that I get more enjoyment out of. So, I might start trying some new things. As far as work is concerned, we'll see how it all works out. Shout out to all my peoples in the way of Dorian. Man, Dorian, he really did a job on the uh, on the Bahamas. He really did that. Um, I'm praying for all those people and the losses that they suffered um, and all the lives that were lost. You know, we were in um, North Carolina and we came home um, probably the day before. <clears throat> we left Wednesday and the storm kind of hit them on Thursday. Um, I don't think it was that bad. I, don't, I actually don't know. I can't say that because I haven't seen any um, footage or anything like that. Um, my father-in-law lives in North Carolina, so we'll have to find out from him how, you know, how, how it was. Mm. We really don't get too many. Mm. We don't get too many really bad storms in um in uh, Maryland. <laughs> um but when we do get them, um we happen to have a lot of trees in our backyard, which we would love to get cut. Anybody know a good tree trimmer for uh, an inexpensive price? 
Um, the trees in our backyard, we have a lot of trees in our backyard, and they're very old. And we would love to get them cut, but we're not able to. I mean, we have a lot. It's like a forest in my backyard. Um, I can never afford to probably get all of them cut. So, we live with it. When the storms come and the trees start swaying, we just move on down to the basement. And I know some people, <coughs> excuse me, ooh, that got a little hot. I know some people don't have basements, so. Oh. I thank God we have one to be able to move down to. Ooh, get that egg again. It's good. Mm. That's something different. Today, neither of my children, my, my youngest daughter went back to college. Uh, she's a junior, she's back in school. Thank you, Jesus. And uh, my oldest daughter, well, not my oldest, our middle daughter, uh, she is in Atlanta for a concert this weekend. First time flying, woo woo, and she did very well. She didn't panic, she didn't freak out. Mm. Really proud of her. So she's down there. She has some cousins that live down there too, so brother cousins, so they'll look out. For but she says, Mommy. You have to try things, and you can't always have somebody to, you know, try things with you. You gotta do new things, and blah, blah, blah. So she's my free-spirited child, so. Mm. I kinda let her go. Mm. Well, this is my Friday night, y'all. I mean, you know, not much to do. Mm. Children out here. It's me and hubby chilling with our twisted tea and our noodles. I hope everyone is okay. I hope you all are safe, healthy, happy. Love y'all for you know watching my videos. Um, I'm picking up a little bit of steam, getting a lot of views. Um, everybody just keep watching. This is something I do for fun because me and my hubby like to cook. Um, we cook all the time, so why not tape it? Why not let somebody else watch it? Maybe somebody will get an idea. Excuse me. You know, it's all about doing something that you want, like to do. Excuse me. Sunday is the big game. Ravens will be in the house. And um, for the purple and black, we're going to make a meal. Our Sunday dinner is going to be a little different. Um, I'm not going to tell y'all what we're making, but we're going to make a lot of different things that we normally make at our house. Um, little, well, they're not even appetizers. I won't say that. Just meals of different things that we make. Um, so tune in. Um, uh, we'll tape it on Sunday. So I know I will have it at least out by Monday. Um, trying to keep up with this editing thing. I'm not doing too bad, but it's, it's, it's hard. So, um, just keep up with me. Hope everybody's healthy, happy, safe, wherever you are. If you're in the middle of the storm. Please be safe. Please go to the shelters. Um, if you have to evacuate, do what you need to do. I want everybody to be safe. I want all my family to be safe, all my friends and all their family and friends. So please do what you need to do. I love y'all. I'm going to keep giving out, the, doing these videos um, as long as I can. As long as there's food. And uh, foodies, uh, I always have food in my house. Um, so have a good night. Love y'all. If you like it, press the red subscribe button and subscribe to me so you can always, you know, see all my videos, see what's going on, um, check out the food, um, hang out a little bit. Love y'all, but tonight, you gotta go. Good night.